you may ask me why not just to start creating documents from the beginning of the course? Why you need all this theoretical stuff we are talking and talking about? The answer is simple. I want you to understand what happens behind the scenes when you enter this or that MongoDB command. But no worries, this is the last module before you will start creating documents yourself. And you will create exactly the same document as you see now on my screen. But in this module we will talk about MongoDB types more deeply. Before we have discussed what is BSON and what is JSON and what is extended JSON. Remember that Mongo stores documents in internal database using special BSON format that have much more variable types than standard JSON. In this example is just an example of the document taken from Robo3 team. You may easily see most commonly used BSON variable types in MongoDB. Namely, strings, objects, arrays, integers, long integers, double numbers, booleans, dates and of course object IDs. There are several variable types more, but uh, we will focus in this course mainly on those variable types because they are more common. Remember that each JSON document consists of key value pairs. And in this example in the left column you just see keys or names of those pairs. And they tried just to give such names that you will immediately understand which BSON types those keys refer to. In the next section we will discuss how you can represent mentioned here BSON types in the extended JSON format in the shell mode. See you shortly.